Greetings, Cancer, <clears throat> and welcome to your horoscope. Start out with the moon in the 8th house. I mean, this is one of those weekends, I'd say, things could be really intense emotionally. It could be a windfall for making money. You know, you might make money, other people's money. Somebody French or something, you make some money for them. You sell a car for a friend because you, you know somebody needs one, you know, that kind of thing. Much more likely to happen. Um, I think Monday and Tuesday are like your more power days this week where you're going to be really feeling much more on top of your game. I mean, Sunday night won't be so bad, but, um, you know, those will be better days for travel and good fortune for you. Um, it's interesting, Venus and Mars are in the fourth house, so, you know, decorating your house, you, you know, your cancers, you probably have the wilder Halloween decorations, right? And, um, and, you know, like I said, Halloween night is a night to be very, very careful because sometimes, you know, people just do kooky things, especially when the moon ends up in Aries. You know, we don't always think, we're not always conscious, you know, and it's a, it's just a place where, where things could be a little bit dicier and, and more dangerous, I suppose. Um, Relationship-wise, things are transforming. Scorpio time is good. It opens up your heart. It's a good time for you to be with children. It's a good time for you to work on creative practice, see yourself as a teacher, work on more positive aspects with your relationship to your father. All these things could could pan out really well under the um, <clears throat> under this week, you know, and, and what's going on this week. Well.